NWSL season is officially underway. Oh, Sean Nahas will want her to be doing, you know, it's, it, you don't want your centre forward checking all the way. You can see now she's got to get a lot of, like, make up a lot of ground and she's there. To be fair to her, she's making a run. Long distance shot! <laughs> Wow, that came out of nowhere. No pressure on the ball, and Guile appear to be the one. Yeah, it's a great strike. I mean, I think Eddie France would be disappointed with this one because it wasn't much pace on the ball, taking nothing away from Guile. Caroline, to be fair to her, was all the way down the other end, checking towards the ball, and then caused a problem. She was able to gain ground. You can see here, you know, she, to be fair to her, Tyler Lucy down the right-hand side. Guile picks up this ball, you know, and, and there's not much pace on it. I'd expect AD France to, 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 to do a better job with that, I would. I mean, it's in the corner, but there was a lot of time she had to pick her spot. And fair play to her, you know, if you, they say you don't shoot, you don't score. But, you know, I do think that the Kansas City Current should have been pressing her, should have been, you know, getting out to it. And Swanson with the corner for Chicago. Oh, and a miss hit right in front of goal, and he's there! It is a couple of times, but she just keeps it alive. It's Ricaro once, it's Ricaro again. And then here's Nagasato keeping herself alive, just tempting at the front post. She d does the easy job. That he just is so thrilled she's on this one. San Diego. Chicago haven't cleared the ball. Almost a horrible error, and it's there. It's the equalizer. As she joins in centrally here, watch her check her shoulder. She sees where Aaron Wright is and just follows. Alyssa Nair gets the first touch, but it's not good enough. It bounces off the top of the bar, and then Ali just keeps herself in. Corner for San Diego. Looking to come from behind. Shaw with a strike! And what a strike it was as well. Take of this because there's challenges here. You get a challenge on the ball. Well, the next opportunity is always going to be at the top of the box. And Shaw just keeps everything alive. And the way she strikes this, so pure. Laces to so it. So that. Back into the danger area. Sasso overhead. Well, was that a penalty? They wanted one. And it's been awarded a penalty to Chicago deep into stoppage time to draw Chicago level before half time. And Swanson does it. It's 2 2. And what a. She knocks down right and then Swanson steps up. It's more craziness in the last few minutes. Oh, it is, please. Here it comes. Here we go. It's Alex Morgan. She's claiming that's handball, and it's a penalty. Two minutes to go, and it's a penalty for San Diego. Points. It's Morgan, and she finds the bottom corner. Alex. The black, isn't that? Yeah. In the NWSL. Hits wise. Now here comes Trinity Rodman. Takes on the early shot, oh, and it's there! Oh, what a strike! What a finish from the player who has lit up this game! Fabulous opening goal from such a talented player. An individual taking over as they're continuing to find cohesion in the final third, and that player is Trinity Rodman right now. Just sees the space, gets her head up. You can see her take the look to see where Tullis Joyce is, there's the look, and just fires it low, keeps it low through traffic, and just tucks it into the far post with her left foot. That's an excellent finish by the 20-year-old. Rico will find Pistol Dunn with her speed. She's able to get to that ball somehow. Shigita's cross, Sinclair, shot save, rebound, goal! Reavers in the right place for Portland. Strike from Christine Sinclair. You can see Crystal Dunn here. Shows her speed that we know she has. Picks out. Christine Sinclair here. Great first touch for Christine Sinclair. Anna Morehouse does get a touch to it, but I still think her defenders have to react quicker. Maybe because she, she could have got a stronger hand to parry it out of bounds as opposed to straight into the half. The ball from which was back on the 
play. She's such a She's even had it all. Off the block. Sinclair cutting it back. Two nothing. Sophia Smith. She made that, that finish. It was all about the run. Again, poor from the Orlando Pride. Christine Sinclair was tenacious and she picks out Sophia Smith. Shows so much composure to do that. The drill has to go through the ball then. She has to go through the ball. Because again, there was no options. Smith from Weaver. Sophia Smith looking, shooting. Bobble in front, and there's the third goal. Sugita. It was almost a carbon copy of the first goal to do I, I had no words for that. I just stopped. That, that was, was brilliant. Brilliant from Sugita. Brilliant play. Again, numbers four, and Smith leading the way. Plays it in front, goal for nothing. Last Gonzalez, the sub, is on the board. It's absolutely incredible, look at that. Great bit of skill, Paddy Strong goes the complete wrong way. Sagita's even looking back to see where the players are. Sophia Smith picks up the ball here. You know, there's only one place she's going, 1v1, nice scissor, nice step over, goes past. Picks Vasconcelos out, fantastic. Really, really good play from Sophia Smith. And Sugita, I love that time. Pickett delivers. Skews up. Borges drops it back. A shot of support there is Salmon. Salmon! Lund pokes it over the bar. Bounced away from Salmon. Tees up Garris again. Gliding into the penalty area. Ball across. Bobble. Lund trying to get back on it. And now Bounce. she's. Advantage played here by Daniel Chesky. And curled it frame. Punched over by Campbell. And McDonald a slip on header. Pick it. Kanu kick save away by changes of the offseason. Ball floated in front. Diving header. Lund. Follow up. Lund again. Dives down at the post and hangs on. Ordonez just the ball got to Sanchez. And this is the type of ball that just has Diana Ordonez written all over it. It's bending. <laughs> BMO Stadium in Los Angeles, where there are a lot of celebrities in town. Julie Fowdy, Natalie Portman, all got together just a few moments ago. Very powerful owners and investors in there. Some very familiar faces too. Is he tonight? And Eligio Aragin gets. Here is Thompson. So so positive. So positive, and she scored. What an extraordinary moment! Alyssa Thomas from the young 18-year-old just does so well, finds the space, and then just a little cut to allow the ball to roll across her, opens up and just fires that into the top corner. What a strike from Alyssa Thompson, and what an introduction to the NWSL. This was a frustration for Carlos Amaros. Oh, here we go, here we go. That could well be a penalty. Well, it's not been given. The goalkeeper, Haricic, came flying out of a goal. She didn't get the ball. The referee to make that decision. They can, of course, stick with their original decision. This was the moment that Haricic came flying out of a goal. This is what VAR are looking at. These are their pictures. That's the goalkeeper came out to get the ball. Urged to go and have another look suggesting it was the clear and obvious error. And he has decided to change his mind. Penalty awarded. He says, I've seen it. It was a foul. And that's the end. Gotham, here's Midge Purse. Looking to go herself. He said, it's Williams. Williams with a strike. And what a fabulous goal by Lynn Williams. And Gotham have turned this game on its head. They're standing. There's a win from Yasmin Ryan. And then Mitch Purse just driving at the back line. Looks to play Yasmin Ryan initially, but just the understanding that they've narrowed the, the field. Angel City defensively. And then finds good weighted pass. So then Williams, they'll take it first time. Just far post. Makes no mistakes about it. Nothing that Heritage could. 